We proudly present Vitter's Moulding Alloy. Positioning a vac mat polymer mat and an unmachined workpiece. Sucking down the workpiece using a vacuum. Drilling centre holes to accommodate the positioning pins so that after milling on one side, the same position can be found on the other side. Milling contours on the first side, taking care not to mill through so that a maximum vacuum is maintained. Freeform surfaces also be milled on the first side. Melting down the LM70 alloy at 70 degrees Celsius. Pouring should take place when the workpiece is clamped onto a vacuum chuck in order to avoid distortion of the material. Pouring the melted alloy into the first side, making sure to leave an even top surface which can then be vacuum clamped with a vac mat for machining the second side. Spreading out the LM70 moulding fluid evenly into complex parts. When LM70 has solidified, it is fixed with a second side up onto the vac mat using positioning pins to find the correct position. The second side is milled out in Z and you can see that the workpiece is only held embedded in the LM70 moulding material. holes are drilled. Here we see how the finished product, the housing of a mobile telephone, is held in the LM70 alloy. Now all sides have been milled All that remains to do is to remove the workpiece from the moulding material using hot water. The mobile telephone housing is cleaned using a paintbrush in hot water. 
take care, danger of burns. A beautiful workpiece with spherical surfaces milled from all sides. The Vita logo with the oracle is cleaned using a paintbrush in hot water. The last workpiece, a doll. This is a very complicated part, milled from all sides. The original raw material is removed from the water. All blocks used to prevent the piece from having direct contact with the bottom of the water bath are removed. The remains of the LM70 alloy are brushed into a corner of the bath to solidify into one lump for further use. The LM70 moulding material can be used over and over again without loss. On the left-hand side, you can see the dislodged plastic parts. On the right, the acrylic plastic still embedded in the LM70 alloy. LM70 moulding material is dangerous to handle when hot. For your own personal safety, we advise you to use a face mask, goggles, leather gloves, jacket, jeans and safety shoes. Always have the room well ventilated. Our alloy moulding method can be used on all materials that can be milled. It is possible to use liquid coolant at any time during the machining process. Only the items listed below are necessary to successfully use Vita's moulding alloy. We wish you much success with our Vita mould clamping technology.